Hello everybody, this is William Frisbee, and welcome back to more Super Metroid. In the last part, we didn't really do much, we just got here to where we can make some more progress, and in this episode... Oh crap, I know where this is. We're gonna be fighting this jerk, Krokemeyer! And the only real strategy you need to know is that as soon as he opens his mouth, you shoot a missile into him. Be a good idea to use your super missiles, as this will send him pretty far back. Really, is this a game of push and shove, where you have to push and he shoves you back. But thankfully, if you're like me and you've beaten this guy quite a few times, he is not hard at all. This has to... The only thing you have to really look out for is that one move right there where he starts uh, throwing fireballs or whatever the heck he's throwing at you. And this should be... Well, no! What are you talking about? I hit him. I hit him like two times. Okay, here we go. This should kill him. Or not. Okay, now... Yep, here we go. And... Aww. Am I the only one that feels sorry for this guy? I mean, come on, he's a skeleton now! How's... Oh, that's just pitiful, really. And I know this might seem suicidal for me to do this, but there is an energy tank up here. And if you have the wall jump, or at least if you know the wall jump like I do, you get an extra energy tank and you get to the sequence break for it, so... That's all good. So... Yeah, do that if you... No. If you do that. And I don't know why I said no there. So let's just run all the way... Oh, ow! Well, it doesn't look like we can come over here, but why is the screen shaking? Why is the screen shaking? And... Spring shaking, spring shaking, what? Okay, stop now. Whoa! Oh, come on, man! You're just making me feel more sorry for you by the second. I know I pushed you into lava, but... Ah, uh, he's dead. <sighs> I feel sorry for this guy, seriously. I really do. You know what's worse is that he probably was just a... Uh, innocent monster that... Really just was minding its own business. And the only reason why we killed it was because we were doing it in self-defense. Yeah, I feel really sorry for that guy. Uh, sometimes it's kind of hard having a big heart for some things. Oh well. Okay. If I remember correctly, you're supposed to need a... Yeah, we're supposed to use the gravel bean to latch on that thing that was up there. And then go through that door and we can get like an item or something, but right now we don't have the gravel beam so we can't do that. Excuse me. Gonna cut that part out. And... I'm gonna think about it. This was probably where I died the last time. Like, you know the time that those times I've been mentioning where I would like, when I was uh, playing and I died after having made two hours of progress? Yeah, this was where I made those two hours of progress, and I died just right after I killed Krokemeyer, so imagine two hours after this part of the game. Yeah. I was pretty pissed. And decided just kind of sc screwed the whole entire thing and just decided to just stop. And get the upgrades and... No! Whoa! Thank you, Spikes, for knocking me all the way over here! That was nice of those inanimate objects. And I don't think I can find any secrets in here, so wait for the lava to go down, and jump. Yep. Get some stuff, and we can get out of here. There we go. So it just got me another missile expansion. I don't really know how many we have right about now. I would estimate around 70, maybe. 70, 75. And... Okay, what we're supposed to do here is use a power bomb. Blow out all these things. Whoa, forgot about these guys. And... I've been saying that a lot. I probably should stop. And Oh. Okay, I think this thing could be destroyed by a... Ah, this is... Why do I have to talk about everything that I do? Seriously, I'm not... You guys aren't idiots. Why do I keep thinking that you guys are idiots? Or having to explain every little detail? You guys can think for yourself, can't you? I mean, come on. Whoa. That 
need to jump across these things because they move down. If you stand on those things for too long, it doesn't really matter now. Now that I'm in lava, now those things take quite a bit of health from you. Okay, if I remember correctly, if you... Oh, ow. If you come over here and use this uh, sh spark jump or whatever it was called, the shining spark jump, I think you can... Uh... Actually, no, if you do it right here... Well, okay, I'm just going to try to experiment here because I'm pretty sure that there is a another secret expansion that you can get up here. That's right. See, because if you go over there, you would notice that there is a gap right there, so we can go... Whoa! Ah, oh, it was a missile expansion. That's what it is. So if we can get over there, we can get him extra missiles. And... Yes! Whoa! What the heck did I just do? Did you see that? I threw, like, fireballs out of my butt. And hips and whatnot. And it destroyed something over there. I don't know what just happened. That was awesome! Well, anyway... Let's go back over here and go through that door that was right through here and nothing but door. And, oh yes. Yes, finally we had a grapple beam. I've been waiting for you. Took you a sweet time getting to me and stuff. Let's see if there's a secret in here anywhere, and there is not. So let's just get our grapple beam out, and there we go. And this grapple beam can be used to destroy uh, some of the weaker enemies, so that's a pretty nice um, secondary effect, so there you go. Whoa. And for some reason, I don't know how you destroy these guys outside of using power bombs or ice beams or whatever. But for some reason, I have this distinct feeling all of a sudden that the grapple beam is key to destroying them. But that could just be my imagination and consciousness. There we go. Alright. Now I know that there's nothing over here, but just so I can get the... There we go. Just wanted to clear out the map space so that way I would know I came over here. And there we go. Whoa, no. Whoa. Green, slimy things everywhere. Let's destroy them. And I did. Why was I talking like that? And... Yeah, there we go. Oh, come on. There we go. I don't know what was wrong, you see. There, just kept... kept playing out that thing. Okay, we don't need to get anything down there. So, let's just go back up here. And we can get the other expansion that was missed. Along with a few other things. First, I need to save. Because I don't want to have to lose all that... Uh, data and stuff again. I swear, that was one of the worst parts of my gaming career, was having gone through like two or three hours of uh, progress, and then all of a sudden, pfft, nope, you're gonna have to repeat the whole entire thing all over again. But now, let's see what's in through here. It's probably a... N Ooh, power bombs. Nice. And I'm gonna use one of those power bombs to make sure that there isn't another secret area in here. You never know. And of course there isn't. So, just go back up here. I wanted to check my map there, but okay. So, uh, yawning. Looks like I'm going to have to go back to where that yellow dot is over there. Where the energy refill thing is and check to see if there is any way that I can go down there. And then once I do, that should be the end of this area, whatever the heck this place is called, and... Well, oh, I feel so sorry for that guy. Don't know why, I just do. And now we can go through here. Yep, jump, and jump, and jump. Rule of three everywhere. And now we can get our energy refilled and we kind of desperately needed it by my count. I usually say 
you have less than half of your energy, that's just a good idea to try to refill. And put the put the put the put the and this could be a very useful way of getting out. And there we go. Ha! And we are in a place that I was in before that really didn't really matter. But now that we have the power bombs, we can regress into this other area. Wherever the heck this leads. Oh, I know where this is, and we can't go anywhere because we don't have all the proper equipment and stuff. Oh crap, then. You know what? I'm thinking of probably cutting this episode in a minute. But first, I want to try to get out of here and try to find a good place to stop. So. I think I'm going to cut. Yeah, I'm thinking I'm going to cut now. So, I am William Frisbee, and I'll see you in the next episode. And when we do, I think we'll be finally reaching a place of some great, better importance. And we just throws a thing. Anyway, see ya. Bye.